Spice shares a six-page letter that she wrote to Carly explaining to her why she feels like she betrayed their friendship. This is part two. Let's get into it. But it's been months now I've been telling Carly that why would you give me a, a fake knockoff bag? I, I don't do that. I don't, I don't play those games. Like, it's, like she, like, it's just disrespectful. That's disrespectful. So when I said it to her, I was saying it for her to say, no, here's the receipt. Because if Carly come to me right now and she say, oh, your bag that you bought for me was fake. I don't even have to have the, the physical receipts. I can go to Versace store or go into Louis Vuitton and give them my cell phone number and they can bring up the the long the, the 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 long list of things that i purchased from the store it's recorded there in every transaction all i have to do is give them my number so the carly that i know the the long time that i've been accusing her because it's an accusation it's an accusation because me a girl me always a buy things and shop and re 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 and mr dc i come off of the ceiling bag and the e catch up on one place and you know look so right so me start accuse i said the bag Fake. It not have to be a fax. But you that come with a receipt. I said to her, I can't I can I continued and I said to her, the fifth thing that concerned me was when your friend listen you know, I said was when your friend had with my ex-man behind my back. And I was told that you knew about it and you did not tell me. I said, however, when I told you about the incident, you acted like it was nothing and you continued to show up with her in places that I was in as if it was nothing. But if the shoes was on the other foot, you would have wanted me to stick by you. I said, however, I've grown and I've learned to accept that loving someone in a certain way does not mean that that person is going to love you back. When our friendship started, it was showing, when our friendship started showing signs of betrayal, it was hard for me to digest. I said, sadly, my life cycle has always been whenever I love someone, they always betray me. I said, it doesn't matter how much of my heart and soul. I said, it doesn't matter. I said to her, I said, sadly, my life cycle has been whenever I love someone, they always betray me. And it doesn't matter how much of my heart and soul I pour into them, they always in return just walk over it. My reaction to you last year was wrong and it was mirrored by the fact that I was feeling a familiar feeling of betrayal. And I was more hurt by the feeling because it was coming from you, the last person on earth that I thought would have hurt me. I said, I remember when you were crying to me when we were in Jamaica. You said, if no one else in this world have your back, you know for a fact that I had your back. All I wanted was to feel the same way from you. I said, so when you started to doing the things behind my back to hurt me, it hurt me deeply. And it caused our friendship to become complicated. I said, I hope that all of this explanation can bring you more clarity for peace and healing. And I wish you God's grace. That was the letter. I know Carly do not want me to read the letter. So she kept saying, let me talk, let me talk, let me talk. No, L read the letter. Listen to why I'm angry. Stop making it seem, stop, stop making it seem like, like I'm crazy or stop painting me to be a villain. Stop telling people, oh, I'm this person and that person when you know who I am. Stop doing it. I was good to you. You was friends with me for five years, almost more than five years. So now all of a sudden, you want to paint like me as this person. I was shocked when Princess said to me that Carly called me. She, you know, she was talking to me. She was telling me where you were and stuff like that. So how did Carly get to decide who visit me while I was dying? It was wrong. I felt some kind of way because people who I wanted to probably open my eyes and see, I didn't see them. I don't have time to play games. I don't have time to play, to tell lies. 
and a pin princess comment so that y'all can see that this is not no made up story because a lot of you like to talk about oh this is made up or this is this is real life this is not where people are make up i'm gonna need for make up story for love and hip-hop i'm a real artist something that y'all y'all seem to be taking for granted i have to make you know the real truth and so yeah, me want to go over the things them. I already telling you about the bag. I want to understand that very clearly. But imagine the situation because I'm telling you, I'm not going to talk about this again. So I'm going to speak in my own language now. Who get it, get it, and who not get it, get it. Carly was with friends. Carly was friends with a girl. The girl was in Justin. Come here, can't call people name. Because I have proof and I have receipts. So when a lot of you talk about, oh, I'm going to sue you for defamation of character. It's not defamation of character if it's true. So I'm calling names because it's true. Because when I love to talk about, oh, this is a made up storyline. I don't need to make up story for love and hip hop. My story, my life is real. My life is a real life. I'm a real artist. I don't have time to play games. So when I call name, it's because this is facts. This is not no storyline and this is not makeup story. Nobody can come sue me for no defamation because what I'm speaking is fact. So let's take it back. Carly was friends with, what the girl name again? I don't even remember the girl name. I don't remember her name. Shit, she do makeup. What the girl name? I don't even think about them. I don't remember the girl name. Carly was friends with a girl. The girl was in Justin. They didn't tell me, but I found out, okay? I'm not going to tell you how I found out, but when I found out, I confronted Justin, I confronted the girl, I confronted Carly. You listen to the story, right? The girl used to come to my house to do my makeup. She used to come at my house all when Justin in at the house. Remind, mind you, they used to have a relationship. When I confronted them, them say it was before me, so they didn't feel like, oh, I didn't to tell me it's not. No, them stopped talk, and I did before me, and it never, them never feel like it was nothing because of this and because of that. But I don't care if it was 100 BC. If you're going to come to my home, when my man there, I in my face, I do my face, you need to say that. Like, don't hide behind my back being my man's ex-woman and up in my face. What? Who, who is crazy people? Who, who does that? That's crazy. And you know the worst thing about it? Them turn around and make it look like I'm me crazy. So who not going to tell me if me crazy? No? Stay tuned for part three.